Hey everyone, welcome to another uh, movie review. So this is warning ahead of time. This is going to be a spoiler for Toy Story 4. So if you have not seen it yet and you don't want to be spoiled, you got to stop watching because I'm going to be talking about the storyline and how certain things uh, connect with other movies. The one thing I will say before I start talking into spoiler reviews, if you have not seen any of the Toy Story movies yet, you have to see all three before you see the fourth one because there are characters and uh, storylines that you have to know about to understand where they get to in the fourth movie. So, now that I said all that here we go this is into the spoiler part of the video so if you don't want to be spoiled stop the video now okay i'm giving you a five second warning five four three two one you've been warned okay so toy story 4 uh goes back about about seven or nine years to back when Andy was still somewhat of a kid, and uh, the whole and w when Bo Peep was still around, and when Jesse was around, uh, and and uh, the the horse I forget the horse name. Anyways, uh, the whole beginning part was uh, them saving RV uh, because RV was stuck and was being washed away and in the driveway so they go they save uh rv but as rv is being saved uh they uh, as they're pulling him up from uh outside to the inside then the mother closes the window and takes bo uh, bo peep and the sheep away uh, because the daughter, uh, bon uh, I don't know, I forget the the daughter's name, uh, Andy's sister, doesn't want Bo Peep anymore because she's grown up to the point where she doesn't, in her mind, she doesn't need Bo Peep anymore. So uh, this guy ends up taking her away, and as he's taking her away, uh, or before he, he gets to take her away, uh, and she's in a box. Keep in mind, uh, she he puts the box uh, near the back of his car, and uh, I guess he forgot something inside, so he went back. And as he's doing that, Woody has gone to uh, uh, to try to convince her to and the and the sheep to stay, uh, but she feels like. Uh, it's her turn to leave and uh, move on and she wants him to go a uh, woody to come with her but in the end he can't because well he, he has to end up with Bonnie for that for the third story the toy story to work so that's how she went away because if you watch Toy Story 3 you see, uh, over the years gone by, uh, toys disappear, and then that's how that starts for that one. But anyways, so uh, fast forward to present day, um, uh, Bonnie is going into, I believe it was kindergarten for the very first time, and it's a... Um, I believe you go to kindergarten one day just to get your kid uh, familiar, not familiarized with uh, what the routine is. So she goes there one day just to like let you know or let her know what it's going to be like. So it's not as much of a shock to her. And Woody uh, doesn't want to uh, for her to be alone. Uh, because when when Andy went through the same situation, uh, he, he Andy needed Woody, so that's where that comes in. And but everyone's telling Woody not to because 
um, uh, they're not allowed or toys in kindergarten. So uh, he ends up going anyways. He helps Bonnie out without her knowing. And that's where, uh, um, what's it called? The uh, spork uh, toy comes, uh, Spoony uh, comes. And then after that, they go on vacation for a week. And that's where they end up going to um, uh, the carnival and uh, the this poor keeps on wanting to leave and Woody's like trying to keep her the f spork from dis disappearing but he ends up uh, jumping out of the RV uh, Woody ends up going after it that's where the big adventure really begins and so uh, the whole thing is uh, Woody bringing the spoon uh, spoony uh, back to uh, where everyone else is at the carnival and then uh, just before they head back they uh, they see the antique store and it has a lamp that was associated with Bo Peep and, and he's like oh maybe Bo Peep's there so he goes in and then things go awry and Spoon gets uh, captured by the evil creepy dolls wire and uh, Woody's the only one able to escape um, and then, uh, that's where, like, they run into Bo Peep, and Bo Peep, uh, after a little bit of a situation happens, they, they try to get him, uh, eventually they do, but they meet, first they meet, uh, Duke Boom, uh, and that's C A B. O O M, not K A B O O M. Uh, I think the the C instead of the K is because of the whole Canada thing, and I still say to this day that the best line that I heard in this movie was uh, "Yes, I Canada," which I thought was hilarious. Um, so, anyways, eventually um, the somewhat evil. Uh, girl toy Gabby Gabby wants Woody's uh, voice box so they can fix her voice box which in the end they do uh, to able to get Spoonie back but the girl that uh, Gabby Gabby uh, wanted to be her person ended up not wanting her in the end and that like just got wrenched for her so and and I felt sorry for her because she tried all this just to get it, and then, and then in the end she didn't want him. So Woody's like, "Well, why don't you come with us? And Bonnie will play with you." So that's where, uh, so they, they're like, so they come up with a plan, and uh, and Buzz is there too at some point, and Buzz is sent back to the RV to make sure that they're meet at the caravel or merry-go-round or whatever anyways um they eventually get there but as they're getting there uh gabby gabby sees this girl that's crying because she's lost and gabby Gabby's like i have to go because she needs me and i need her so they end up uh helping each other out and getting her there and at, so once they've done that they go and uh catch up with the rv that ends up back at the carnival and um um uh, and pretty much at the end uh certain things happened and bo peep doesn't go with the gang and a certain other character which i won't say uh stays with her which is but it's going to be kind of obvious who it is and uh they help uh other toys as the carnival goes to place to place so that kids can uh, get toys to uh, so they can have their own experience instead of being uh, stuck on the wall the whole time so uh, overall great movie I'm telling you right now you will you will cry at the end I, I cried at the end not like balls crying out, but like you will cry for sure. 100% guarantee. Um, 
please go check it out. And uh, yeah, oh, there are a few end scene credits, but once they get to the main credits, don't bother staying. So uh, whenever you watch this, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, and see you all next time. Bye-bye.